Welcome back. Today's video is an extension from my previous video, which is design process. So this time, we talk about site inventory and analysis. What element should you consider to do site inventory and analysis? First, you must prepare your key plan, location plan and site plan. In order to start your site inventory, other than preparing key, location and site plan, you must study all these elements so that you know your site very well. When you have your base plan, you can start study neighborhood context where you acknowledge any existing property surrounding area. After you study surrounding neighborhood, you can identify site zoning specification to outlook the urban pattern of the community area. This identification will help you to classify your design in which type of architecture style. Next, we move to circulation, which means movement to and from or around something. While accessibility is the quality of being able to be reached or entered. When you do the inventory of this topic, you must consider all these elements in order to design your circulation, your entrance and your exit for your site. Natural features include topographic, natural drainage, locate existing plants, restriction development and flora and fauna. Any structure surrounding area other than building are considered as man-made features. In this topic, you must study the size, shape, height, location such as retaining wall, bridge, pavement and others. This will help you to design the building that suit with surrounding environment. Are you with me so far? Hang in there, okay? Just a little bit more. Now let's continue with... When you want to start your design, you must know the condition of the site. Like how the wind flow, the direction of the sun, the rainfall, the temperature and also potential catastrophes. Sensory is when we use all our senses to find site potential. All this you need to experience yourself when you are at site. Utilities is an organization of supplying the community with basic necessity. In this topic, you need to study the nearest point of each supply so that you can design accordingly. Human culture is where we study about cultural and behavior sociological aspect. You need to do a survey or interview to get all this potential information. All this information is a data for you to understand more on user. Before you start your design, you need to identify neighborhood architecture style and legal description of the property so that you design based on the certain district or any special requirement from local authority. What we just went through 
is site inventory where you just collecting data. The method to collecting data is either you doing interview, survey or you can refer to local authority. Okay, that's all for now. We will continue on how to analyze your site on the next session. Bye!